Howdy, howdy, friends, and welcome back to a super awesome CVS haul. I just grabbed probably over $100 worth of items for a $2.75 cash moneymaker. Definitely stay tuned to see how I was able to pull that off. Thank you guys so much for coming back to another video. I so appreciate it. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. I want to hit 10,000 subscribers by the end of this year. And you guys have been doing so awesome by coming back every week, sharing my channel with your friends and family. I so appreciate it. So thank you guys so much. Um, so yesterday after my Walgreens haul, I went to CVS, just grabbed another one of those little pretzels for $1.29, used my 20% off email coupon. Remember to use the email one, not the one that is in your, um, prints at the bottom of the receipt. And then the next day, early in the morning, I went kind of late too. It was probably like 7.30 ish. And then the next morning by 6 AM, I had the 10 off of 70 spin threshold in my email. So that's been working like a charm. So that's been working like a charm. I hope it's working out for you all as well. So I think that's about all I have for you guys. Oh, today, um, the 29th, tomorrow, April 30th is the last day for the Sam's Club promotion of $14 for a year membership, normally 50. Oh, oh my gosh, he broke this again. My daughter made this and he broke it the last time. So that, of course, is going to be linked down in the description box below, as well as in a pinned comment. And also in the description box is the free okay. printable list. Um, watch the video, though, because that's where a lot of the details are. And the um, Ruby apps that we use are down there as well, because if you sign up using those codes, you do get bonuses when you submit your first receipt. So I think that's about it for now, and we'll see you guys in there. <laughs> So Garnier this week is buy two, get a $4 extra buck. So the cheapest products at my store are these um, Sleek and Shine leave-in conditioners at $4.59. You want to pick up two. That is going to total $9.18. There is a $3 off of two Garnier Digital. And there is that two off of two Garnier CRT from last week. So you've had to have clipped it. Um, so Because I think they extend. Mine actually expires today. I don't remember when I clicked it. So um, if you don't have it, this still will just be $2 higher, but hopefully you guys clipped it. So I would pay for 18, get a $4 extra buck back, making it just 18 cents for the two or nine cents each. So head and shoulders is buy two, get a $5 extra buck. So I'm gonna pick up two, they're $7.99 in my store. Two of them will total $15.98. There is a $3 off of two head and shoulders digital. And check if you have this CRT for $4 off of 14. One of my accounts, I have that. My next, my other account, it's like a five off 20. So um, if you have that, you'll pay $8.98. You'll get a $5 extra buck back and then submit to Ibotta for $2, a dollar on each one. And I have an Ibotta bonus for 25 cents back when you buy two. So it's gonna make it $1.73 for the two or just about 84, 85-ish cents each. So cover curl is the buy two, get five. But as far as what digitals I have, what I'm gonna do is, cause I do have a 10 off of 70 that I'm trying to reach. So I'm gonna grab one of these blush at 7.79 cause there's a $4 CRT that you clip in the app and a $3 off face. Cause I used my $3 eye last week. Um, if you have them printed out, you can definitely use those as well. I looked on coupons.com today and I didn't see any new ones to print out. Or if you have the paper inserts, there are $3 in there. So definitely the best day, way to do that would be to grab two of the I, but this is how I'm gonna do it just with the digitals I have. $7.79, $7 in digitals will come off, making it just 79 cents. So Dove products are buy two, get a $5 extra buck. So this is how I'm gonna do the deal because of a fetch offer I have. So last week I completed, I got the degree and it was like 1500 points when he bought two degree sprays. And then that prompted a dollar for dollar on any of the degree dove deodorant spray deodorants. So I'm gonna get a thousand points per dollar and I'm not, I'm gonna do this on its own. I don't wanna grab or use extra bucks to pay just cause I'll fetch picks up the CVS receipts. And if you use extra bucks, it like brings the price down. Like it's just super weird. So what I'm gonna do is pick one of the sprays at 1049. 
And then I'm going to pick up one of the Dove Hair Care, which actually it's a little bit better than I had anticipated because online they showed up $5.29, but in store they're only $4.99. So the total for this and the spray is $15.48. So I'll pay that. There, I don't have any coupons to use. Definitely check if you possibly do. But I'll pay $15.48, get a $5 extra buck back, submit to Fetch for $10.49 on this spray. And so yeah, it's going to make two, these two items completely free. So Shea Moisture is spend 20, get a $10 extra buck. So you want to pick up one of the whole body deodorants. They're $10.79. I actually grabbed this stick. It's in my cart already. Then the next item I'm going to grab is this Shea Moisture gel. It's $9.79. So the total for both products is $20.58. There are two different $3 digitals for each of them. So after the $6 in digitals come off, you're left to pay $14.58 get a $10 extra buck back and then submit to Ibotta for $1.75 on the gel and then to fetch for $3 on the um, deodorant stick. So that makes it a 17 cent money maker. The next deal I'm going to grab is on the Gillette. They are buy one, get one 50% off, buy two, get a $4 extra buck. So I'm going to pick up one of these Gillette sensors, um, men's at $7.79. We do have a $3 digital for this. And then the other item I'm gonna grab, let me move all my stuff, is the Women's Venus. It's also $7.79. Um, there's a $3 digital for this. So one will ring up half off. So the total for two is $11.68. After your $6 in digitals come off, you'll pay $5.68, get a $4 extra buck back, making it $1.68 for the two or just 84 cents each. So in that same promotion of the Gillette are these foamies. They're $3.89. Two of them would total $5.83. You'd pay that. There are no coupons needed. You'll get a $4 extra buck back, making it $1.83 for two or just $0.91 cents each. But keep in mind, this is a limit of one per household per week. So you'll have to pick and choose which deal you want to do. So the Dove hand soaps are buy two, get a $3 extra buck. They're $5.29 at my store. So picking up two is going to total $10.58. We do have a $3.99 off of two digital. So you would pay $6.59, get your $3 extra buck back, making it $3.59 for the two, or just $1.79 each. Here is a super easy deal. You can pick up two Colgates that are priced $3.99. That totals $7.98. There's a $7 off of two digital, leaving it to be just 98 cents for the two or 49 cents each. All right, so there are tons of the women's health items. They are buy two, get a $2 extra buck, and buy one, get one 50% off. So you can see all tan packs is included. So I'm gonna do this deal by grabbing two of these um, tan packs, pocket radiance or 649. Two of them are gonna total $9.73. There's a $3 off of two digital. So I'll pay 673, get back my $2 extra buck, making it 473 for the two or just $2.36 each. All right, I can't find it at my store, but it did show they had some in stock, but it's on these CVS allergy like nasal sprays. They are $6.29. I don't know if, I don't know, there's something for $6.49 here. But if you can find some nasal sprays at $6.29 or anything right around that price mark, you wanna pick up four. They are in promotion for spend 28, sorry, spend 25, get an $8 extra buck. So four of them at $6.29 is $25.16. There are no coupons, but you'll pay that, get an $8 extra buck, and then submit to Ibotta for $12 back, $3 on each one, because that is a limit of five. It's going to make it $5.16 for four sprays or just $1.29 each. All right, let's work on a spin 30, earn 10. You can pick up one of the Downy and Stopples at $6.99. There's a $2 digital for this, as well as a $1.50 back on Ibotta. You can grab a Tide Pod at $13.49. There's a $3 digital for that. And then you can pick up one of these Druft Newborn Laundry Detergents. They are $13.49. And we also have a $3 digital for this. So the total for all three products is $33.97. We have three, six, eight dollars in digitals. So you'd pay $25.97. You'll get your $10 extra buck back. Then submit to Ibotta for $1.50 on the downy. It's gonna make it $14.47 for all three, or just $4.82 each, which isn't the best deal, but if you have a spin threshold, great to throw into that. And good for the draft. We hardly ever get good deals on this. Definitely keep an eye out on clearance water stuff. I've been seeing a lot of people post some amazing clearance. My store, not so much. Um, well, this was like 391 
it's so funny this says a dollar 64 but when i scanned it it was like three or two i don't know it was not a dollar 64 so yeah just scan them in the red box so for this so you want to pick up two of these nature valley bars that are on sale for $1.99 that's going to total $3.98 we do have a 50 cent off of two so you'd pay $3.48 and then submit your receipt to Ibotta for a dollar back when you buy two it's going to make them just $1.24 a box so I'm planning on doing three different transactions one for the head and shoulders because that isn't on the account that I have a 10 off of 70 and then a 10 off of 70 and then the one with the dove stuff on its own and I'm not using like extra bucks or anything to pay We'll see how that works out with fetch so i'll go check out and then i'll go over my receipts with y'all all right let's quickly go over this receipt it was awesome it was amazing i got the nature valley the colgate the tampax the gillette and the venus the garnier the cover girl and the shea moisture all my digitals came off perfectly fine i rolled 26 dollars in extra bucks so my subtotal was 42 cents so adding back in that $26, if you don't have any extra bucks to pay, this receipt is $26.42. I'm getting back $20 in extra bucks. I'm getting four for the razors, two for the um, Tampax, 10 for the Shea Moisture, and four for the Garnier. And I'm getting back $2.75 from Ibotta and $3 from Fetch. So that puts this receipt at $60 seven cents <laughs> awesome on fetch though it did not pick that shea moisture up right away i did have to go correct the receipt i scanned the barcode i will um hopefully by the time i'm done editing to editing this video it will credit me that and i'll pop it up on the screen here but what i will write in my cash cost budget which this was phenomenal friends because i did redeem for a 25 dollars fetch gift card I know your fetch gift cards, it's like 2,800 points for $25. So it's really not dollar for dollar for that. But I'm like, that's honestly kind of free money for me anyway, because I don't count that in my couponing budget um, because I only count cash, cash going out, cash coming in. So I don't count fetch. So I just went ahead and redeemed for a $25 gift card. And that's what I used to pay because after taxes, it was $4.92. So nothing is coming out of my bank account for this haul, but I am getting $2.75 back in cash for my Bata. So this is a $2.75 cash moneymaker for me. And I'm getting that $3 back from Fetch, but I'm not counting that. And then my other receipt, I just grabbed the Dove stuff. Like I said, I didn't want to use any extra bucks to pay. And the only reason why I did this is because I did have that $25 Fetch gift card. Otherwise I probably wouldn't have paid that high out of pocket because I'm getting back fetch money. So it's not real money coming back. If it was cash coming back, then yes. But I use the fetch gift card. I'm getting fetch and I roll that into another probably CBS gift card. So it kind of just all works itself out. And I wanted to try the deal and see how it went. So 1548 was the subtotal. I got back the $5 extra buck for buying two and then the $10 and 49 cents from fetch. So that puts this completely free. And so it was $16.81 after taxes. So that's what came out of my card, but it was a gift card. So nothing came out of my cash um, budget. So I went to the store today, got all this. I mean, I haven't even calculated how much it is, but probably about $100 worth of stuff. And my bank does not even know I went. <laughs> I wanted to do the head and shoulders, but like I said, that was on a different account, that four off of 14. And I was going to the register to do this because I wanted to use that gift card. Um, which you can only use at the register. You cannot use it at self-checkout. And the manager there is not super friendly with me. So I'm like, I'm not even gonna do it. I'm gonna go back a separate time and you get the head and shoulders because that is a phenomenal deal. So like I showed you on the receipts, everything went beautifully. All the digitals came off, all my extra books printed. Well, except the fetch thing that didn't like go through, but that's an easy fix because you just submit a ticket. But other than that, another wonderful CVS haul in the books. Definitely let me know what your favorite deal was this week. Um, and honestly, it's really hard for me to pick which one I like. I do love when we can get the these for super cheap because my kids love these. Um, so yeah, I think that's about it for now. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.